Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how to measure distances in 2D and 3D in Google Earth. Let's go ahead and take a look at Google Earth here in my web browser. And I've got Mount Hood pulled up here. And I want to do a little measurement. Let's say I've identified a little ridge line that I want to check out. Perhaps I'm going to try to climb it. And I want to measure how long that is. So I'm going to use the measuring tool over here. And I'm going to start right up here. And I'm just going to click and drag along that ridge line. And now I'm doing this in 2D because that is the default for Google Earth measurement is to measure in 2D, in two dimensions. And I'm going to keep going right along this ridge line here, all the way down to the bottom right there. And so I'm going to say I'm done with that measurement. And it's 10,496 feet going down that ridge line. But I know there's a lot of inaccuracy in that measurement because there's a lot of changes in the elevation along that ridge line. So I'm going to jump into 3D and take a look at that and see how well did I actually measure along that ridge line. And you can see here I've zoomed in and I actually am not on top of the ridge line up here. So I might want to move that little marker so that my measurement becomes a little more accurate. And you can see my measurement starts to change as I start to move my measurements around. And I want to make sure I'm lining that up to the top of the ridge line. But if I go too far, I'm going to start to measure things that are not on the ridge line either. So you really want to zoom in and make sure you're moving it very carefully and precisely to make an accurate measurement along something like a ridge line, like I've done right here. So that's how you can measure things in 2D and 3D in Google Earth. And as always, for more things like this, please visit freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.